Hey y'all. Welcome back to my channel. Guess what finally arrived? Timu. We have a Timu haul. Um, I'm just going to dive right into it, but I have to say right out of the gate, normally I like to open my items first so that we don't have to hear the rattling bag. But I didn't do that, and so I just want to apologize. And just know if all the rattling bags are grating on your nerves, they are grating on mine too. We're just going to push through and do this. So I'm excited about this little haul. So let's get into it. Okay. Oh, yes. <laughs> I got this for summer. Super cute. Got my little scary blade that freaks me out. I think I have PTSD from a razor blade situation when I was a kid. I was opening a box when I was a kid with a razor blade. Uh, anyway, um, and I'm going to leave this closed. But I just went and sliced right over three of my fingers. Not deep enough for stitches, but enough to where it was, it was blood everywhere. It was a whole thing. Anyway, so now I'm like on high alert when it comes to razor blades. Look at this bag I got, and I thought, how cute is this going to be for summer? Now, I'm going to stand up and show it to you, holding it. I'm in my jammies. Don't worry about it. I'm in my jammies, okay? Look at this. Do we love the colors? We're going to get a thumbnail with that. Look at this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hold it so you can see the size. Oh, yes. That is so cute. The colors jumped off the screen at me, and I had to have it. I had to have it. And it's just a, a dump bag. It's got a zipper. And it's going to hold a lot. Look at that. So cute. So stinking cute. You can just carry that anywhere. You can travel with it. You can carry with it or carry it to work. Carry with it. Um, pack it up. Load it down with all your things. Gosh, that's so freaking cute. I love it. I love the size. We'll have that. Okay. Let's see what else. Okay, this is a little tank top, a workout tank top that I've had in my cart forever. Let's set this stuff over here. I had it in my cart for a long time and I finally broke down and got it, but what got me was the yellow. That's going to be perfect for hot yoga. Isn't that cute? Say la vie, Paris. And I got it in a small, but they look like they run kind of big. That's so cute. And it's coming off, I'm sitting in front of my bedroom window, so it's coming off kind of pale. But in real life, it is bright. It is a bright yellow. It's like two different yellows I'm looking at. So cute. Cute, cute. Okay, here's another little bag I got. Sorry. And make it quick. This is so cute. I am just digging on all the bright colors. Look at that! A little purse! So what you do, I'm sure you guys have seen these, it's, it's cloth and it's got a little bit of stretch to it. They have them in every kind of print, pattern, anything you want. But what you do is you put all your things in it and then you cross it over like this. And that's how you carry it. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. And that's big enough for everything that I carry. I don't carry a lot. Um, unless we're out running around. If Shane and I are out running around, um, I'll carry a bigger bag or just to put all my junk in and then just pull out my wallet and my keys. But this is perfect just for, you know, every day or a, um, I can put my I can put my little cosmetic bag, my wallet which is my keychain wallet, a book. Oh, I absolutely love it. That is cute. That's, and it's thick. That's, that's more than what I was expecting. 
more than what I was expecting. And here's another bag. I just kind of lost my mind with the bags. I was excited about this too. Oh, I love it. Oh, it's got a little wallet. Look at this. Just a girl who loves books and coffee. <laughs> Isn't that adorable? Let's open it. Anytime you get a bag or something from Timu, it has that stinky smell. Oof. Isn't that so cute? Kind of like a burlap. Oh my gosh. I'm probably carrying that tomorrow. This is, I know it's not a purse, but I'm going to carry it as a purse for the next few days at work. That is so cute, I can't even handle it. And then I didn't know it, but I guess it comes with a little wallet. It's got a snap that just, um, where does that snap? Oh, you can snap it on the outside. Okay, weird, but all right. Oh, maybe not, I don't know, let me see. It's not snapping. Is it, does it snap, oh! I'm such a ding dong. It doesn't snap. It's just that accent button. <laughs> anyway, little wallet comes with it. Okay. Adorable. Adorable. Oh, that's cute. So far, so good. Okay, and this was really cool here too. A bunch of little, th little beady things in here. I got some cool kitchen gadgets. You guys saw um, in my last video that I did over the weekend, my butter dish. Riley came home from school and she, the child is 19 years old. She's a sophomore at college. She's about to be 20. And even she had to come apart over my cute butter dish. It was so cute. It's the wooden base with the fat glass top, like the bell glass top. Oh, it's so cute. It's a big hit at my house. Okay, this is a strainer. Okay, this is so cool. When I saw it, I'm like, get in my basket. Okay, so it's a bowl, right? And then it's got like a spout. And then it has this little piece. And then you just slide this in here. What is that? Do you hear that? Oh. Oh, it's my watch. My watch is on the charger and my phone's ringing. I don't know who that is. Okay, anyway, you slide this. Okay, bye, we'll talk to you later. What is that? Hold on. Okay, we're back. So you take this little piece, you slide it in there, and then what you do is you put your strawberries, your blueberries, your lettuce, your veggies, whatever you want in there. You set it on the side of your sink, and it you can rinse it, and the water pours into the sink. So say you're filled up with fruit, berries, whatever, you're washing them, the water runs out of here and down into your sink. <coughs> Necessary, no. Do we love it? Yes. We love that. We love it. Okay, what is this? Okay, this is... This is mascara. Um, it, the box is smashed, but that's all right. We don't need the box. It's going to go in the trash anyway. Uh, this is Starry Sky Thick and Long Mascara. We'll see. We will see. Okay, the packaging is gorgeous. It's by Skyvy. You know, Timu has different stores. So here's the packaging. Isn't that pretty? Very sparkly and blingy. It's real light. Like, is there any product in there? Hint. Okay, there's the brush. The applicator. So we'll give that a try and see. I, I don't feel like there's much product in there. So, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if it's as good as my lippy that I love, that I need to order. Okay, this I'm going to save because it goes with something else. 
it goes with this right here. So <clears throat> I've only mentioned it once, but I'm gonna try my hand at junk journaling. I've already I've already started a little journal at work, and it's not even a journal, really. It's not like I write down and reflect, and I, I don't do all that. What I do is when I have, um, let's see, if I, if I read an inspirational quote out of my email, I'll write it down. If I've watched a podcast and there's something I want to remember, I'll write it down. If there's a word of the day, just, just I'll write the date and then all my random thoughts for that day and nothing makes sense. It's not, a, it's not, we're not journaling our day. We're just writing down thoughts. Okay. And so I haven't added any decor or fluff or stickers or, or momenta, none of that. None of that. That one at work is just going to be words and my thoughts. And then this one, Aubrey that I work with, she has this and she does do junk journaling and hers are neat. Hers are, are neat. But she's a DIY or crafty person. I am not. But I saw her blank book and I about fell apart. And of course she got on Timu, so she sent me the link and I ordered it. And this is a fat one. I got the same color. She, no, I think she had a dark gray. Yeah, and I got blue, of course, because that's my favorite color. But it's just blank pages. It's called a blank book. And so uh, I love the thickness of it. So um, I think somebody asked me to show you my junk journal. Well, I haven't really I haven't started one yet. And is this going to become a junk journal or another just thoughts on paper book? I don't know, but I'm loving it. So this one will stay at home on my desk. So I'll have one at work and I'll have one here. This is awesome. And this was like $15, but it is, it's sturdy. It's thick. The paper is thick. It's heavy. And we love it. We love that. This goes, you have to order it separately, but I got it to go with it because Aubrey had one. <laughs> and, you know. It was really neat, so I got one, too. She's like, if you get the blank book, you got to get this to go with it. And I'm like, okay, so you strap this onto your blank book, and it holds a pen. Let me get a pen. So here's a pen. Slide that in there. So you slide that in there, and then you strap it on your book. And I catch her writing in hers all the time. She's writing in hers all the time. She just leaves it on her desk at work. And sometimes she takes it home. She's got a million crafts going at one time, all the time. You do that. You strap it on there. So you always have a pen, right? So you're never without a pen in case you have an emergency thought. You have an emergency thought, you need to have a pen. You just have to. Another thumbnail in case I... So I'll have a few to choose from. So I love, I love the feel of this. I love the weight of it. I love the color. I love everything. They have all different colors. But that's what I chose because, because we love blue. We love blue. What else? What else do we got in here? Okay. This is cool and fun. Not necessary. Not necessary. You know, those fun little things that aren't necessary, but they bring you joy and you'll probably use them. Okay, so this is a grape tomato slicer. So this is the lid, okay? You put your little cherry tomato or your grapes. I eat cherry tomatoes like they're going out of style. So you put your little cherry tomato in there and then you do that and it slices it. Put another one in there, slices it. It slices it into quarters. <laughs> and that's pretty sturdy too. Oh, I can't wait to try that. Instead of taking your one cherry tomato at a time and cut, 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 or cut them in half. You, you just pop, slice, pop, slice. Yes, yes, I will use this. Right, what's this? I don't know what this is. It hasn't been too bad rattly yet, has it? What is this? Oh, this is a little, uh, it's a little eyeshadow palette. Because I wear a lot of makeup. I just wanted some real light colors for summer. I don't know, in case I feel like it. Wear an eyeshadow that day. I do every now and then. So here's the colors, just little pinks. A few dark colors in there with a few glittery. 
So this is how I do my eyeshadow. Like, I'll show you right now. If I ever wear eyeshadow, this is how I do it. I take this ring finger and let's just put it, let's just put it in this pink right here. And I do this. I'm not trying to get out brushes. I'm not trying to, every once in a while I will. And I, I literally do this. Ooh, that's cool. That's pretty, isn't it? That's, that's how I do my eyeshadow. That's it. That's all you get. That is all you get. Because I don't know how to do makeup, really. I know how to do what I do every day, but I'm not trying to do the most. That's how a white girl puts on eyeshadow. And it just gives a little sparkle. Just, just a little sparkle. Love it. Yes. I don't know if you can see it. I can see a little bit. If you want to see some incredible makeup, go over to Twisted Gypsy. That girl, it doesn't matter. She can wear every color under the sun. She puts on these gorgeous lashes. It, it, she'll put little stars here. And it doesn't matter if it's green or blue or freaking pink. or It doesn't matter. Her eyes just go. <sighs> it, she's all about the color. And I just love that. I would look like I got punched in the face. I would look like I had two black eyes, even if I wore, it, it doesn't matter what color. Because I believe me, I've tried to do that look before, and I just can't. Okay, so I'll just keep it simple. Uh, this is super awesome. So this is just a pan scraper, and it's silicone, so you don't scrape the bottom of your pan. Because y'all know I got a, a couple new pans to cook in. And so this will, it's just a, a pan scraper. Sturdy. Love it. <coughs> Have that. Okay, I was beyond thrilled when I saw this. Beyond thrilled, because y'all know we eat a lot of eggs in this house. Are you ready for this? I've watched a lot of Timu hauls, and I haven't seen this yet. I haven't seen anybody haul this yet. Maybe nobody's interested, but when I saw it, even Shane was like, okay, that's cool. <laughs> but if you don't eat a lot of eggs or like French toast, or we eat eggs uh, at least four times a week. And I like to fry my eggs. And you know, when you're frying your egg and you want a yellow run, a run, words, and you want your yellow middle part to be runny, you gotta flip it and sometimes it breaks, it's a whole thing. Um, look at this, shut it. So you're frying your egg and you're ready to flip your egg, right? So you scoop up your egg, squish this down and flip it and let it go and pull it out. <laughs> what? <laughs> I was like, Shane, you will not believe this spatula thing I bought. You're not gonna believe it. Let, I mean, scoop, pinch, flip, let loose. I'm sorry. I am, I'm just having to come apart over all my new kitchen gadgets. Love them. Love them. Okay, so I did see, uh, I think I first saw these watching um, Twisted Gypsy. Miss Sherry. I saw her haul these, and we all have Roku remotes, right? Most of the world has Roku remotes. Well, I have one, two, three, four. So I only ordered two of these for downstairs. I need one for the bar in the garage, need one for up here, but I'll get them later. I wanted to just get a few and see if I liked them first, but they're remote holders. You slide your remote in there, and then you can hook them to whatever, which I won't. But you know the reason I got one, because also not necessary. <laughs> These are not necessary. But the reason I bought two of them is because of the bright color. You know when you're losing your remotes and you can't find them, and they're black and they're little, and you can't find them? I thought, I'm going to get bright colored covers so if I, I I can find them so I can see them which is also what I did in my cell phone case I bought a hot pink which hot pink is not my most favorite color I don't dislike it but I bought a hot pink glittery sparkly cell phone case so I could see it it's an old, old woman thing anyway there's that that's traffic my bedroom windows open okay there's that there's another one in here somewhere there should be did they not put it in here? Oh, yeah. Yeah, they did. And then y'all know a girl's got to have her green, her chartreuse. Neon yellow. There's a difference, but whatever. Look at this color. Yes, please. So, 
So we're going to put these on our remotes. And if we like them, we're going to order two more in our next haul. So love that. Okay, okay. Look at this. Oh, well, let's look at this first. Look at this, and, but look at this first. I got these for work because I, I take my lunch three or four days a week. I take my lunch. And I'm at work, and I'm like, I don't have any salt and pepper. I could go all the way down to the first floor and get salt and pepper down there in the little, I call it the gas station, but there's a convenience store with a Starbucks. You guys have been in there with me before when I've ordered my coffee from the cute little girl that works the register. Um, I think it's her and her parents that own it. I call it the gas station, but it's just a little convenience store and they have salt and pepper down there. But if I'm not buying something, I don't want to just go take all their condiments. So I bought these. <laughs> Are those not the cutest things you ever saw for my lunch, my lunch pack, my lunch bag? I'm freaking out. These are so cute. I can't even stand it. They remind me of the old Tupperware. Oh, that popped up. Oh my gosh. I can't even get over it. I'm, I am I was so excited about my little kitchen gadgets. So I'll fill them up and I'll just leave them at work. I'll put them in my desk drawer. Yes. Okay. And then here's another little kitchen gadget. This is a color changing egg timer. Shut the front door. Have you guys seen these? Stop it. So what you do, it changes color as the egg cooks. So cute. And all the reviews were great because I'm like, does it really work? Because I suck at boiling eggs. The last two times I tried to boil eggs, they weren't done enough. And then I had to boil them longer. And Wyatt's like, mom, get out of the kitchen. Let me do it. Both my boys can cook way better than I can. Um, their dad and I taught them how to cook. We brought them up in the kitchen from when they were, I don't know, old enough to be curious and go, I want to help mom, you know. And so my boys were raised in the kitchen and they both to this day love to cook and they come up with amazing recipes all on their own. And uh, well, they have trumped me by far. I've never claimed to be a most fabulous cook, but I can cook my boys and they love it like I do. So anyway, back back to my neat little purchase. Look at this. So he's flat on the bottom, right? And you put him in your in your pan of cold water and you put your eggs in there. And then here it says when it changes colors. So you let it change colors up to like if you want your eggs hard boiled, it'll turn like a red or some other different color. To, and it'll let you know when they're done. And isn't he cute? He, she, oh my gosh. Soft, medium, hard. I can't wait to try that. Love it. I just, I just did the most with the kitchen stuff. Okay, and here is, what is this? Uh, I think this is a lippy. A uh, Vibly Starry Sky Lipstick. We got a lipstick. See if we like it. It's absolutely gorgeous outside. My neighbor's azaleas are just bloomed out. I'm just heartbroken that I had to rip mine out because the storm the storm killed three azalea bushes and my and my um, dogwood. Yeah, the dogwood about broke Shane's heart. So it's sad, but we can put more in the ground. But my neighbors, his survived. The art still looks good though. Okay, here's a lippy. Same, same little blingy packaging as the mascara. Pretty, pretty. It's thin like my lip gloss was, and this is red. This is a red. Should we put it on? Ooh, let's try it. I'm gonna get up in your face. Do you care if I get up in your face? You'll be all right. Let me see. It's hard to do in the phone. Ooh, that's bright. I cannot see. Here we go. It might be too bright. What do we think? Do I need to pack it up and ship it off over to Sherry? Because she'll wear some bright lipstick. I 
might be able to pull it off. You know what? I look like my grandma. My dad's mom. <laughs> my dad's mom wore red lipstick sometimes. And my mom, she'd wear red lipstick sometimes. Mm, that is bright. I think I'll keep it. I think I like it. I think I like it. We have to make several thumbnails, right? Okay, so I'm happy with this. And it's creamy. Now, listen, y'all be honest. If it's too much, just tell me, please. I'm, I'm asking for constructive criticism, please. But I think, from what I can see in this lighting, I think I'm going to I think I'm gonna keep it. I mean, I'll keep it, but I think I'll use it. And it's creamy, and it's soft. I don't buy... Um, a drying matte lipstick very often because I can't handle that nor do I wear lip a lot of lip color very often mm, I like that yes goes good with the boomer senior sweatshirt what else what's next we're almost done okay I got a watch band my watch bands for my Fitbit are I man I wear them out and they're wearing out even quicker because I wear my Fitbit in the um, hot works in the sauna. And so that wears them down. But this is just a white one with a really cute pattern. Isn't that cute? I got solid white this time because the last watch band I bought was all the bright colors. Do you remember that? Hold on a second. Let me see. Where'd I put it? Where'd I put it? This is the last one I bought of Timu, and I absolutely love it. But you can't just wear it with everything, you know. I wear a lot of black and tans and muted colors, but I, you guys saw this. And so since I went wild and crazy last time, I just went ahead and got white this time. This one's stretchy. This is just a rubbery. Okay? Okay. And I busted out and bought some ankle bracelets. Irene. Sweet dear friend and viewer Irene got some ankle bracelets from Suzanne's Bling Boutique and she put pictures on Facebook and hers was a diamond glitzy fancy schmancy one and it was so cute and her husband just went nuts and although I don't really get into a lot of rhinestones and bling I do like bright colors uh, I'm getting into bright colors and I found these and how cute are these gonna be for the summer <gasps> oh, ankle bracelets Oh, newsflash, I broke down and painted my toenails. Are you proud of me? I'm such not a girl. I'm such not a girl. I'm going to hit pause and get these put on. Hang on just a second. Okay, I got them put on. But what I was saying is I haven't painted my toenails all winter. Because usually in the winter, nobody sees your toes. So I let my toenails breathe, and then in the spring and summer, I'll paint them again. And I did them myself. I'm kind of proud. And they're a pretty lavender. So first of all, can we see the lavender? Can you see it? Love that. Hold on, let's do this. Let me bring you down here. I look silly, I know. Oops. Can you see them? I'm 50, bear with me. Those are cute. Now these little chains on the bottom, I'm gonna have to take those off, but yes, we love those. I feel like that was a workout. Those are cute. Cute, cute. Be cute with some sandals and some denim shorts and a white tank top. Look, I got it all planned out. I got it all planned out in my mind. Okay, here's some rings. And this, I wasn't, I wasn't real sure of these. But the reviews were great, so I went with it. I went with it. And there's four rings and they stack. And I got gold, size six. So let me, let me put them on. So here's one little rhinestone. Isn't that precious? Dainty. It's perfect. The next one is a wider band with one stone. You see it? There we go. 
I think the hole for all four of them was like, this might be a little too big. Uh, I think for all of them was a dollar and some change. And here's this one. And they had different sets you could get, but I wanted this set. And then you can wear them separate or together. And here's the fourth one, love. love. And this is what they look like all stacked up together. Oh, isn't that pretty? Okay, very happy. This is another one of those things that looks richer than it is. Don't you love it when you order something for less than $1.50 and you look like you just went and spent a whole bunch of money? <laughs> it's like my favorite thing. I just realized Kips is gone. Oh, yeah, look at that. Go, Timu. Yeah. Ooh, yes, yes, please. And then, of course, I'm usually rocking a silicone wedding ring because I sweat and I work out. So, I work out. All right, so there's that. 30 minutes. I oh, know, it's taking forever. It's fine. Okay, this is super fun and cute. Super fun and cute. This is adorable. It's tiny. Hi, Chips. What you doing, buddy? It's a little bumblebee. Okay, and I have little bumblebee earrings that I had planned on wearing with these with this. Focus. Okay, you see it? And they had bumblebees and stars and okay, so what it is, it's like a little clip. Oh, please don't break. Ooh, I'm gonna have to Oh, it's probably gonna break. Please don't break. Does it does it how does it work? Does it twist? What does it do? Does it I can't turn on light? I can't see. Okay, it's supposed to open, it's on a hinge. Oh, no, it's not on a hinge. Okay, so what you do is you put it on your ear up here. It's a little ear, ear, ear decor. Ear cuff, is that what they're called? Put it on there. <laughs> Stop. Stop it. I don't know if I have it on right because I can't see, but hello. Is it cute? Somebody tell me if it's cute, I can't see. Anyway, I have little bumblebee earrings. <laughs> it's just a barely there, a little bit of barely there bling. I don't know how long it's gonna last though because you have to bend it to slide it on and off your ear and I don't know how long that's gonna last because it's not on a hinge. I'm gonna have to play with that, but that is, I'm gonna put this in my jewelry box right now because it'll get lost. That's in there. Should we leave that light on? Probably no. There we go. Okay, here's another little pair of earrings that I've had in my cart forever and finally broke down and bought them. I cannot see tonight. What is happening? We're losing light. But we're almost done. It's fine. Y'all ain't got nothing else to do, do you? Let's drink your coffee and let's hang out. But no, really, I'm almost done. These are precious, let me take these out. Now these are a little blingy, but they're so tiny. Since I keep my hair short, I have a tendency to wear smaller earrings now. Earrings. Oh, they're iridescent. Yes. These also jumped off the screen. My computer screen. I don't always like to look at Timu on my phone. I want to see it on a computer. I want to see it blown up. I want to see a big picture. You know what I mean? Oh my gosh. Look at these. Somebody tell me how they look. Oh my gosh. They're real lightweight. Oh, they come with metal backs and, and the rubbery silicone backs. I like the rubbery silicone ones. Oh, I love how these feel. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Move little hair. Aw. See, that's the kind of bling I like, where it's just a little bit, a little bit. Yes. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yes, yes, yes. 
Okay. Oh, is that it? Did we reach the end? That's the end. What is this? I don't even remember. Oh, it's a ring. It's another ring. Because y'all know I gotta get my jewelry. Gotta get my jewelry. Look at this. I love a wide, these wide bands. It's got a heart on it. Silver with a gold heart. Can you see it? Look at that. This had a lot of great reviews too. I mean, and if we're being honest, everything that goes in my cart, I didn't used to, but now I look at the reviews, I look at the pictures. Every once in a while I'll take a chance on something, but I just read all the reviews and if it has less than four stars, we're not getting it. I don't care if it is only 99 cents. I'm not putting it in my basket if it's gonna be a wasted dollar and this fits perfect. How cute. You know, I have bought a lot of rings off Timu, and I have been happy with them. Very happy. None of them have turned yet. Oh, we love it. Okay, that's the end of the road. I am happy with everything in this haul. I'm completely happy with everything in this haul. I'm excited about my bags. I'm excited about my jewelry. All my little kitchen funsies. My lipstick. My tank top. We're happy with it. And you guys saw I put my sticker, my emotional support water bottle. So this cup is Timu. The sticker is Timu. And y'all know I have, I'll put this on here and I've run this thing in the dishwasher on repeat. And that sticker has not come off. And then, you know, the other sticker that says, I don't know, ask Jesus. I put it on the back of my phone. <laughs> it's so cute. Okay. I'm going to let y'all go. Cause I'm probably, you're probably tired of me by now. And I need to clean up my mess. I love you. The Lord loves you more. Thanks for hanging out with me, and we will see you in the next video.